about the burners room is uh, we have three levels, like I said earlier. Uh, up, upstairs, not many people who see it from the outside would even understand how big this room actually is. We have some pool tables. You can pull out a ping pong table if you want to uh, have a ping pong match with your friends. A jukebox. Uh, this goes out to our outside patio. Patio is our box. So there's one entrance and one exit on each level. Um, so you can enjoy the summer breeze during the nice days. This is a great place for families to gather, have a graduation party, um, bring in your birthday party here, I mean, anything you really want. Uh, this room kind of facilitates that perfectly for you. Uh, uh, again, we have larger round tops, and all that's done by local artists. Here is the brown room of the pipe room. This is where typically the pipe room is used for the majority of the time throughout the months uh, as, a, as a live concert room. Um, this is where the bands hang out, uh, load their gear in, uh, break their gear down at. Um, it's a little small room for them just to be separated from the audience. We also have green rooms downstairs that, are, that, that can be used for the artists, shower facilities, um, laundry facilities. Office with facilities that are on the road, maybe printers and all of that stuff, fax machines. But this is what we, we offer uh, as, a, as a hangout spot. If you come from here, you enter this area. You enter the actual pipe room. This is a, it's a great place, the next stepping stone for your band after you fill the room down there in the burner's room, or if you're uh, already beyond that. Uh, this is the next spot. Uh, plenty of touring acts come through here. It's 250. The capacity of the room is 250 people, so uh, you know it gets utilized a lot uh, with, with the touring package that are, that are coming through, especially in the indie rock scene. This is this is a hot spot for bands to come and play. It's a fully functional bar, great sound system, uh, great lighting rig, plenty of uh, plenty of stage space. Merchandise space. Um, you can also, we also we have we have we've had people get married on this stage, and they go down to the ballroom and do their their reception there. Uh, private parties, club nights, smaller events like that, birthday parties. I mean, you name it. Every each one of these rooms in here is it can be used for for any sort of event. Or, uh, Okay, so Sharon, let me, um, uh, it's a 250 seat bar, right? Yeah. And if I'm an up and coming band, what's, what's the procedure for coming in and, and playing a show? Well, we have our own buying talent, our, our talent buying team here. 
I myself was one of those people. And uh, you know, you you would email us, uh, send us some some music, some information, some things that you've done in the past, uh, what you're trying to do, and we'll try to make that work for you. Uh, typically, a lot of the times this is getting used for a lot of national access coming through. But if we can start you in the burners room, you can put some people to the door, we can bring that to this room. But email us on the on the, the, the girlfoot.com and find our emails. Uh, Chad, that's me. Justin, uh, which is another gentleman, and Greg Bates, which is another gentleman that we all work here, and we all put the music in. Oh, wow, that's fantastic! And also, uh, any bands uh, watching us that are uh, interested in playing the, this room, is um, we have a merchandise center too. Right? Yeah, like and T-shirts, and must sell CDs and that sort of thing. Yes, yep, that's 100% the artist to keep too. Uh, oh, really? It's wow. good to know. Yeah, sometimes uh, venues will take a percentage of your merchandise sales because. But uh, you know, we, we give 100% off the merch to the artists. Uh, we have a great light system, you can see. Yeah, uh, it's just great. It's really great. It's a, it's a fun place to play and it's a good place to watch shows, especially in the music, in the setting like this. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've had everybody, like I said earlier, uh, the, vamp, the Vampire Weekend's played here, Passion Pit's played here, uh, AC Newman from the New Pornographers has played here, Curse has played here, Dillinger Escape Plan's played here. Uh, you name it, they've been through. Maybe not your name, but close to it. <laughs> yeah, no, that's awesome. That's good to know. Uh, what's going on next on the tour? Uh, well, we're going to take you down. I, I think Freddie and uh, Kristen are going to show you the ballroom. Okay, and you guys are going to really be surprised at what happens because that's an amazing layout. I'll see you guys downstairs. Thanks, guys.